Our next competitor comes from Iceland, Julia Silvia Gunnarsdottir, 18 years old, third Junior Grand Prix season, 20th after the short program. And she'll need an 80.53 to take the lead. Julia Silvia Gunnarsdorti from Iceland, you can see understandably frustrated with the mistakes, but a triple toe that was glorious and arguably a skater that has some more commitment and drive and attack to her choreography than we might even see from some of those in the top group. Lots to admire, just a skater that as we saw last season on the Junior Grand Prix, struggling just to process all the passion that she has in the competitive environment at this stage. I think that's one of the reasons it's so devastating is because she knows how good she is and knows what she can do and knows that that was so far from what her standard is and what her abilities are. That is very frustrating. You can completely understand that and, you know, we support you through 
As we look at that triple total, look at that. The mechanics of it, beautiful. Straight in the air, tight in the air, up into the double loop as well. Three jump combination. Outstanding. You have the skill. You did not produce it here tonight. For whatever reasons, you'll figure that out. A little loopy, a little open on the triple salka. But nice, straight, strong back. Good aggressive throughout the program. Didn't give up. Kept fighting. Love that. But it was not to be on this day. Lessons will be learned. You can see just there, just how intense. I think intense is, is such a good word to describe her commitment there. The Kevin Amos slide and ability to have you know, difficult movement within the choreography and delivery of it. Just, you know, I, I, as I talked about the team leader that's here to support her and her coach, Benjamin Aguiar, they have to do so much work to help get the skater to feel comfortably confident to replicate their potential within a three and a half minute program. You know, this I'm sure is a skater who in short, sharp clips is quite sensational. Yeah, and I think that right now she's going through a processing, mm. uh, she's processing all of this and it'll be a little emotional in the beginning and a little lost for what happened and then start to analyze and then common sense will come down and say, okay, let's, let's, let's make sure this doesn't happen again and they'll work for it. This is a process for all skaters. Mm. Sometimes when you have a great performance, you get too confident that you're just gonna repeat it. And that may not be the case. So you have to be thinking not too high and not too low. Keep yourself balanced. As we take a look at the scores. 70.21, that's second in the free program. For the 110.20 for Julia overall in the competition, and that'll put her for the moment into second place.